Spice Girls legend Mel C claims that her immaculately dressed and headline-hogging co-star Victoria Beckham is far less confident than fans might think. The 48-year-old chart-topping singer has known singer-turned-designer Vicky for decades as they first joined together as members of the iconic girl group back in 1994. And while 48-year-old Vicky was never really well known for her dancing skills or vocal abilities, she has carved out a space on the global stage as a fashion designer. But while Victoria seems to have no problem endlessly splashing herself all over the headlines and social media, Mel says her fellow bandmate is less confident than most might assume. Speaking to The Sun on Sunday, Mel reflected on the 2007 Spice Girls tour which saw all five original members perform together. Recalling the fact that Victoria opted to walk down a catwalk rather than sing during her solo spot on the tour, Mel explained, it's all she needed to do, but she can do so much more. There's an element of her not feeling confident enough. Sporty Spice went on to continue discussing her hope that the group will reform next year to perform at Glastonbury as a five-piece. She said, 100% I'd like to do it. I believe that is too big a gig for VB to be busy that night. And discussing the band in general, she declared, I love working with the girls. Sometimes it's a pain in the A. But I love them dearly. We played to our strengths. We know where everyone's talents lie. Earlier this month, Mel C, who has been promoting her new autobiography, Who I Am, dished on Victoria further. Thinking back to the day they signed their record deal, Mel explained that Victoria was so drunk in a taxi ride away from the Virgin Records signing that she threw her knickers out of the window. The girls' manager Simon Fuller was even forced to pay the cabbie an additional £50 to cover the mess and to apologize for the terrible behavior. She wrote in her book, By the time we arrived, the taxi was a wreck, there was lipstick, champagne and flowers all over it. Somehow, Victoria's knickers ended up being chucked out of the window. We steamed into this incredibly posh restaurant, stinking of booze and ciggies, and crashed onto the table. The other diners were not amused. By this point, Victoria was so drunk she pretty much fell asleep face down in her dinner. She was still niggerless. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at Web Celebs at Mirror. UK or call us direct at 0207 293 3033.